Doesn't look like any sisters at St. Peter's Prep back in Minnesota. Yeah, obviously she doesn't look like that now. But when I first saw it... No, 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 no. I understand. I do. The imagery from our faith is a powerful thing. There's a reason it's been around for over 2,000 years. Except I'm not sure I can say it's our faith, Cap. I don't know what I believe in. Lapsed Catholic, still a Catholic. No, I can't help but wonder if this reaction isn't just you having second thoughts about asking this woman to move in with you. Is that what you think it is? No, well, you haven't really talked about her in a way that would make me think you're considering cohabitating. I really like her, Cap. I don't doubt that. I just, I remember you telling me about things getting real with Christopher's teacher. Anna. And that's when you started having your panic attacks. So you think I'm a commitment phobe? Mm, you don't seem to have a problem committing to certain things. Military, this job, your son, Shannon. That was a lot of the reason why we got married at the church. She got pregnant and I think we both felt pressured into it. But I never regretted it. And even when things got really bad, there was always a part of me that I loved being married to her. I'm not gonna tell you how you feel about Marisolity. Only you know that. Okay. So shoot it to me straight. As a practicing, confession-going Catholic, <laughs> if it were you, what would you do? As a practicing, confession-going Catholic, what would I do? Mm -hmm. I would probably go to confession. I would want to piss off her ex. The Lord. 